President Cyril Ramaphosa has told the State Capture Commission that he considered resigning as deputy after President Jacob Zuma fired Nala Nene as finance minister in his cabinet reshuffle. Ramaphosa gave his testimony at the commission on Wednesday, 11th August, with his capacity as country's president and deputy president. In December 2015, Zuma decided to give Nene an axe, replacing him with Des Van Ruyen, who became known as the Weekend Special because he only served in the portfolio for four days. Unhappy by the decision, he then informed the African National Congress Deputy Secretary General, Jesse Duarte, that he would be stepping down as Zuma's second in command. When the legions of the state capture allegations emerged, implicating Zuma and the Gupta family, President Cyril Ramaphosa said it became clearer that a network of people colluded with people in government to occupy key positions. He also says as deputy president, they needed to decide on the best way to adequately respond to the sage. According to Ramaphosa, there were several options that he was considering. To resign, speak out, acquiesce in the bed, remain and keep silent, or remain and resist. What do you make of this? Let us know on the comments down below. Lisa Grayson, The South African.